As you probably know, Photoroom is the best AI photo editor on the market with over 200 million downloads used by brands like Netflix and Amazon. But what you might not know is that there is a very good chance that you're not using Photoroom right. I mean, over the past year, we've added so many new tools and features to Photoroom. You can pretty much think of it as your creative agency in your pocket. Mm -hmm. And so if you're still editing your photos like it's 2024, well, we have news for you. In this video, we're going to show you exactly how to use Photoroom in 2025 to get the most out of your product images. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and let's just jump straight to it. Once you open Photoroom, the first thing you will see is the create page. What I would recommend you to do is to pick a picture that you wanna work with. We're gonna start with this beautiful image of earring and tap on start from photo. And what's gonna happen, Aisha? Background removed instantly. That looks wonderful. Yeah, background is gone. Uh, fun fact, Photoroom was actually started as background removal app, and we're pretty good at it. As you can see, the background was removed perfectly. When you zoom in, you can see like all the details are gone. But if for some reason we didn't do a good job, what you can do is tap on cutout and... Yep. You can either erase more of the background or you can bring back other parts of the background to restore and you get your perfect cutout. Yes. So once you're happy with your picture and the background, the next step is to prepare it for your listing. What do we need to do here, Kaya? Let's do white background. You can pick whatever color of background you want, but if you're an e-commerce seller, you'll most likely want to go for a plain white background because that basically creates that studio quality shot. And as you can see right now, the image looks a bit odd and that's because it's lacking. <laughs> we need an AI shadow here to go along. I think the best shadow for this image will be the hard one. Wonderful. That looks amazing. Ready to sell. And the coolest thing about Photoroom is that it actually allows you to edit your object and the background separately. So if you want to edit this pair of earring, make it brighter, more sharp, all you have to do is tap on your product and scroll down and customize your picture. You can edit the color, sharpness, brightness, contrast. It's older. Yeah. All right, I mean, this photo is looking great, but there's a chance that you might just not be looking for a white background and maybe you want something a little different. This is where our fantastic AI backgrounds tool comes in. So you can just tap it, it's right there for you in the editor. And once you click on AI backgrounds, you'll be able to see what your product looks like against our library of AI generated backgrounds. And you can also create your own background right from scratch and make literally any background you want. So you can scroll down and see all these amazing AA backgrounds that Photoroom is recommending for you. And then when you scroll all the way down, you'll be able to see a bunch of recommendations, like different fabrics, different themes, holidays. You can pick one of these, or you can actually create a brand new AI backgrounds by just tapping on create background and describing with prompts, text, whatever background you're looking for. So let's say that you want to create a background that is uh, beach and pink sunset, but beach. you want the sand to be gold. Gold. <laughs> Whatever you want. The idea yeah. is that you can basically describe your own scene. You can also use a picture as inspiration, upload the picture to Photoroom. So let's say that you've been to a beautiful beach and you want AI background to create something similar. You just upload your picture yeah. and AI analyzes the picture for you and creates a bunch of recommendations. Yep, something else I can also add to that is that you can actually select the AI background model that you want. Mm -hmm. And so you can try our brand new studio model for hyper-realistic shots. It literally creates backgrounds that are indistinguishable from reality. So that's a tip for you. So our earrings are looking absolutely fantastic right now, but I still feel like, you know, for a listing, you probably need more than just one image. So you still need to use these earrings to make some other product shots. Where, where do you go from here? Like lifestyle pictures? That would be amazing. <laughs> <laughs> we did not rehearse that before, not at all. Okay, there is actually a great feature on Photoroom that can help you create beautiful lifestyle shots. You can put these earrings on an actual model. 
an actual AI virtual model, but it looks super realistic. What you have to do is that go to AI tools. The first thing that I always recommend you to do is like scroll down because we have a lot of AI tools. And that's honestly like the biggest difference between Photoroom 2024 and Photoroom 2025. We yeah. added so many AI tools that can help you to create incredible things. But anyways, going back to virtual model, tap on virtual model, then choose add your photo. So we're gonna choose that beautiful pair of earrings. And the next thing you're gonna do is that you can choose your own model. You can either pick one of the models that we have in the app, or what else can you do, Aisha? You can upload your photo. You can choose a photo of another model you've worked with. It can even be a famous person. All you need to do is select your earrings, select the model you wanna work with and you generate your photo in literally less than a minute. Mm -hmm. This is looking amazing. Yeah. Oh my God, I am so proud of us. Honestly, We're ready to start our e-commerce store right now. Virtual model is probably my favorite tool right now. Same. It's crazy. Like it honestly is crazy what it can do. And it's a brand new tool. We just launched it a couple of weeks back. So just give us a couple of more weeks. I mean, or a couple of more months. It's gonna be crazy. Yeah, I think there's already so many sellers using virtual model today and uh, you don't want to be left behind. So join them. Just give it a try. Honestly, it's, it's really impressive. But Aisha, what can I do if my product is not something wearable? What if I'm working with skincare or candles? Amazing. Well, we have another tool just for you. So you can try out product staging, which mm -hmm. works very similarly to virtual model. The only difference is that it really does what the name says, product staging. It stages your product. Hence the name. Yes, hence the name. <laughs> it stages your product in a lifestyle context and basically shows what your product would look like in action. Okay. Let's work with this skincare product. So basically the flow is the same as with virtual model. All you have to do is add your product and these are the results. Like how so crazy cool. is that, right? I love this. And you know what? The, we actually have one more yeah. feature with a beautiful name and the name is product beautifier i really think this one is a very amazing one because what product beautifier can really do for you is enhance your product photos it makes your product more beautiful pretty much exactly so let's say that you have like an old pair of shoes that doesn't look very nice anymore like what you can do is add that into product beautifier and it will analyze a picture and make it a lot better look at that that's looking so clean Insane. and it takes care of all the details. So the background is better. The features of the product are a bit more enhanced and the colors are sharper. And it, it simplifies your workflow because you don't have to clean it. You don't have to repair it. It basically makes creating content and product shots much easier. easier. So you don't actually need to start with a picture that already exists. The best thing about Photoroom is that you can create a picture from scratch, like realistic picture. Picture. You can create a picture without taking the picture. Does it make sense? Oof, I love that. <laughs> so go into AI tools, select AI images, and you will see a bunch of tools. Basically recommendation of images or graphics that you can create with AI images. So what can you do with AI images, Aisha? I mean, you can make pretty much anything. Just last week, I made a logo for my friend's business. She's mm -hmm. kicking it off already. It's a bakery, by the way. It's a very yummy business. You can make uh, coloring pages for your kids. You can generate gift cards, business cards, birthday cards, or even realistic <laughs> images of people. Like AI has gotten so good that you can describe a scene. Like let's say two girls hanging out in Paris, you know? Yeah. Once you get an image that you like you can tap on the free dots and customize it or generate more images similar to that one so let's say you want to change something you know you want the picture to be taken at night and not by day or you want to change their hair color whatever customizations you want to do you can do that at any time by changing the prompts I know by now you're probably wondering what else can this photo room app do well, there's a lot more that we can do, but for the purpose of this video, we're moving to our next suite of tools, which are our editing tools. Mm -hmm. With Photo Room, you can retouch your image, you can resize it, you can upscale it. You can basically like customize every single aspect of the image to really make it exactly what you want. Let's say you took a selfie, but it wasn't your day and want to retouch some pimples, some wrinkles, or you want to remove people from the background of your pictures. That's you can a do that. One. Yeah. If you want to resize a photo for multiple platforms, resize is a tool for you. Pretty much 
anything that you're trying to do with your photo is possible in Photoroom. I think that's the whole purpose of this video. Mm -hmm. Plus, we have AI Expand, which is an amazing tool that you can use to expand your photos. Say, for example, you wanted to convert a picture from an Instagram story to like a vertical banner for maybe your Facebook uh, page. Using AI Expand, you don't need to crop the photo and you know go through the whole headache of trying to figure it out. You can simply just up upload the photo into AI Expand and AI would automatically resize it and mm -hmm. expand the sides to fit the context of the original image. So it looks perfect, like it was made you know, already as a Facebook banner without needing any editing. It's really cool. So you don't need to crop, you don't need to decrease the quality of your image. No. You can keep it consistent and keep it high quality and get the results that you need. Okay, Aisha. So we created a bunch of pictures today. Mm -hmm. What do I do if I want to edit them all at the same time? Ooh, we have just the tool for that. You need to be selecting batch mode. So you find batch mode at the bottom of your photo room app in the center. And once you click on start batch, you'll be able to select all the photos that you want to edit. And immediately, Photoroom, of course, removes the background and shows you a bunch of editing options for where you can go from there. You can, like we did before, add a white background, add a shadow, resize. resize. Batch mode is basically one of the coolest tools that we have in the app because it really saves you a lot of time and a headache because you can edit several pictures at the same time. Well, Kai, you asked me a question, so it's your turn to answer one as well. Bring it on. Okay, what if I make I know huge all the answers. <laughs> I do, I do. Okay. That's amazing. Okay. okay, let's have it. So, what if I'm a huge company? I've got like thousands of products, you know, inventory that I'm selling. I have the website. How can I edit all these pictures at once? Do, you, do I go on the app? What do I do? No, you use Photoroom API. Photoroom API basically allows you to edit up to 3 million pictures daily. Can you imagine? So if you're a fashion brand, if you're a food delivery app and you need to edit hundreds or thousands of pictures daily, you get Photoroom API and you can do it all in one click, basically. Amazing. We will link a video up here explaining what Photoroom API is, if you're interested. And there will also be a blog post down in the description of this video. So if you're interested, hit us up. And we'll take care of it for you. And the best part of the Photoroom API is actually the consistency that it brings. Let me paint a quick scenario for you. Say you're a marketplace like uh, Amazon, for example, and you have tons of sellers listing their images and their product on your website. Mm -hmm. What you can do with the Photoroom API is basically achieve this beautiful level of consistency. Mm -hmm. So you can go from having messy photos, you know, sellers are taking photos however they like, to having this polished catalog of images that your buyers are ready to engage with and, you know, shop from. And we know that this raises conversion rates because we've heard it from our API customers. So yeah, if you want to learn more about how the Photoroom API can help you at a very large scale and automate your photo editing, make sure you check the blog in the description and uh, also the video linked above. But just before we go, there are two special features we absolutely have to mention in today's video. Mm -hmm. The first one is BrandKit. What's our BrandKit, Kaya? BrandKit is basically like storage room for all your key brand visuals. It's where you can save your logo, your colors, any cutouts that you're frequently using, or maybe your favorite AI backgrounds that you wanna reuse for different product listing. Whatever you're frequently using, you can save it in BrandKit, so it's easier for you to find it at any stage of your design process. And you wanna hear something very cool. The BrandKit that I'm personally using was actually created by both Aisha and I, because one of the coolest things about Photoroom is that it's an app made for collaborations. You can collaborate with your teammates, with your mom, with your friends, whoever you want on Photoroom. And you can actually share Photoroom for free with two people. So you basically get free Photoroom subscription for the price of one. Right, well, if you're getting started with Photoroom in 2025, you only need a few things. With your mobile phone or your desktop and a product photo and maybe your team, you're ready to go. All you need to do is just, uh, you know, go into the app, play around with the tools, let us know what you think, and we'll always be here to answer your questions. It's important to mention that you can use Photoroom both on your computer, so desktop, and on your phone. The choice is yours. Once you have access to one, you have access to them all. Absolutely. That's amazing. Photoroom is always improving, always adding new features and tools to help you sell more online, create content for your social media, mm -hmm. and essentially our vision is to be your creative partner 
partner in your pocket that you can rely on for any product visuals that you need to grow your business. So let's Absolutely. go. Absolutely. So don't forget to subscribe to this channel and we'll hopefully see you in the next one. Bye.